Hi friend, welcome to my channel and today I will be showing you how to make this delicious out of this world southern style honey cornbread. Ooh child, this cornbread is so sweet and moist. Baby, stay tuned because you don't want to miss this. All right, let's jump right into it. This recipe is fast and easy, child, just like used to be back in the days. But you know what? That's not my business. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add one cup of flour into my strainer. And I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to strain it just to make sure there's no clumps and no lumps and no bumps, okay? Then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to grab my yellow cornmeal mix and I'm going to add some of that into there. And you guys, do not forget, I will have the exact measurements and recipe for you in the description box below. Have no fear. Your girl, Freddie, is here. So then we're going to go ahead. We're going to add some salt. We're going to add some baking soda and we're going to add some baking powder. All right. We're going to add that into one bowl. Then we're going to go ahead. We're going to get our butter. We have one stick of butter, which is a half a cup. And we're going to go ahead. We're going to remove one tablespoon of butter from that stick. And we're going to put the remainder of the stick into a bowl. And then we're going to put that bowl in the microwave for approximately two minutes, one minute and 30 seconds, just until the butter melts. OK, then we're going to go ahead. We're going to take all our dry ingredients and we're going to mix them all together until they have become one as a unit. OK. All right. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to set it to the side and we're going to grab another bowl where we're going to start working on our wet ingredients. So for our wet ingredients, the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to add some oil. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to add a cup of granulated sugar. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to going to add our honey child okay we want this to be nice and sweet we're going to add the honey into the bowl where the butter is at okay not into the, the, the wet ingredient bowl but right here right there okay we want this to be nice and sweet child just like i am right before i ask my man for some money <laughs> anyway then we're gonna go ahead we're gonna make sure we get all of that honey because we want our thing to be popping we want it to be sweet and this is the this is what's gonna make the, the the um the cornbread everything okay this is what's gonna make it set it off now we're just going to go ahead and we're going to mix that butter and that honey together. Use our fork, just whisking it, mixing it, twisting it all together. I'm trying to tell you, child. Then we're going to go ahead we're going to set that to the side. We're going to go back to our bowl with the um that has the oil and the sugar in it. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to add two large eggs. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to add our buttermilk, okay? And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to add a little bit more buttermilk. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to give everything a stir. We're going to mix everything together so that they become one as a unit, child. Just like this, just like that, all right? When you're done mixing it all together like that and everything has combined, we're going to go ahead and we're going to add the honey and the butter into the mixture okay this is what's gonna make the cornbread really sweet it's gonna make it real good it's gonna make it everything and as you can see I'm trying to get everything no honey no butter should be left behind okay all right so then we're going to go ahead and we're going to um, mix everything together. Once we have that in the bowl, we're going to go ahead. We're going to mix all the wet ingredients together. Mix it, whisk it, twist it. Yes, yeah, just like that. OK. All right. Then we're going to go ahead. We're going to grab our other bowl that we used earlier with our dry ingredients. And we're going to mix the dry ingredients together. Then we're going to go ahead. We're just going to mix everything together until they are homogeneous. OK, so just go ahead and mix it, mix it. I kind of want to fold it a little bit. I want to whisk it too much. That's why I'm not using the whisk. Um, um, if you if you see a little clumps and lumps in it when you're done mixing it that is okay it will all turn out well in the end okay? i guarantee it this is the time for me to answer the question that everybody always asks should cornbread be sweet or should cornbread be savory you know what i think cornbread should be however the heck you like it listen listen friend listen i don't got time to be going back and forth with nobody about how food that i'm gonna eat and i like should be the food is gonna be how i like it i ain't got time for that you i ain't gonna argue with you baby if you like your sweet make it sweet if you like it savory make it savory why we gotta go back and forth as soon as we realize that we are not meant to like the same thing the easier life will be. Child, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to one tablespoon of um, butter that I removed from the half a stick. And I'm going to put it everywhere on my cast iron skillet. My cast iron skillet has been in the oven at 375 degrees for about 10 minutes. We want to make sure we get all the corners and all the creases with um, butter and even the size. Okay. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to put the mixture of um, the cornbread that we made into the pan. Then you want to put it in the oven at 375 degrees for about 28 to 32 minutes. And baby, <laughs> baby, 
You know that cornbread look good. Find somebody else to play with. All right. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to take the butter and we're just going to put it everywhere. You know, just to give it that extra little glaze to make it look a little pretty or whatever. To make it look nice. Okay, friend. Look at that cornbread, baby. Look at that cornbread. That cornbread. Now it look good, child. This cornbread looks so good. Let's go ahead and give this beautiful southern style honey cornbread a moment of silence for the beauty that it holds. Yes, shy. Yes, yes. Look at that cornbread, baby. Look at that cornbread. That cornbread is not to be played with, okay? This cornbread right here will make you the cornbread queen of every event. They're gonna be like, hey, you 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 remember you remember you remember you remember, you remember that cornbread last time? You 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 gonna make it again? You gonna make it again for the for the next event? We have them having a little barbecue. You know, you know, the kids ain't got no school tomorrow, so we're gonna throw something on the grill. We're having a little barbecue. You gonna you gonna make the cornbread? <laughs> I'm trying to tell you that's how this cornbread will have the people talking. I'm trying to tell you, baby, don't make this if you don't want to be the cornbread queen. Don't make this if you ain't trying to have everybody and they mama ask you to make the cornbread at every event, friend, because that's what this cornbread going to do to you. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Until next time.